What's up, everyone? It's your boy, Comics Cuts. I want to talk about the story of the MCU heading in to Secret Wars and two items that I think were missing from the story and I wish we weren't. So let's get into it. Number one, you need to understand what incursions are. Some of you probably remember, most of you probably remember incursions coming up in Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness. Now, a quick ref a refresher and definition. So an incursion is when two Earths of the multiverse collide into each other, having an incursion point, an impact, and there are only two outcomes from an incursion. Number one, both Earths explode, killing everyone on both planets. Number two, one planet exploding, the other one surviving. The surviving planet, all, all lives remain alive. The exploding planet, all lives die. So, Tony forms the Illuminati behind Captain America's back. This is a key part of the story going into Secret Wars. Now, the reason Tony forms the Illuminati behind Captain America's back, if you remember in Civil War, Tony and Captain America obviously have a very different perspective on life. And therefore, it changes the way they handle things. And obviously, they have very strong disagreements. Now, Captain America was never okay with exploding the other planet being part of the plan. He wasn't okay using their will to kill lives, let alone billions of lives on another planet. Tony knew that no matter what happened, there was going to be a large death toll. And he felt it was better for them to save themselves than for everyone to die, which I agree with him. You know, by the way, kind of reminds me of the scene in the at the end of the Dark Knight, you know, uh, when Joker gives them each the uh, ignition to the bombs on the other guy's boats. Anyway, now, Tony forms the Illuminati behind Captain America's back. Towards the end of this Avengers by Jonathan Hickman series, Captain America finds out and all hell breaks loose. They have an epic battle for the ages, and it was so brutal, it led into an incursion. You never knew who actually won that fight. Okay, now, that leads me to number two, and you're probably wondering about the incursion, and this gets into that as well. Number two, the rivalry and beef between Namor and T'Challa, which, by the way, for everyone who wanted Namor, uh, sorry, T'Challa to not be recasted, we got absolutely robbed in Wakanda forever. That Namor and T'Challa beef was a one for the ages, and Namor and T'Challa both sat on that Illuminati, and they sat on the Illuminati, and towards the very end, when no one had it in them to use the Reed Richards invented anti-matter injection device, which the idea was to use that to explode the other Earth before it collides with the 616 Earth. So it was the device that they were going to use to save themselves. Now, no one had it in them to use it, but no more. And no more used it at the very end. Now, here's the other thing. T'Challa ends up stabbing the Moor. And the Moor says, it's gonna take a lot more than that to kill me. And out of nowhere comes Black Bolt, using his voice to deal the final blow to Namor and ultimately kill him. What do you think of these two items and how they played out in the story? Let me know in the comments. Thanks.